Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nova Mice here, and we are playing another level of this uh, Lord of the Rings Return of the King Let's Play. I've already done pedaling on fields, but I can't go any further with the Legolas and the Path of the King. So uh, let's go for a bit of Gandalf. And I already know that this mission is pretty hard and annoying. Some people have been sending in the comment section. Um, and as we go into this epic cutscene, which I'm sure will happen, yeah, look at that, that's so awesome. That's a. Uh, and Nazgul and in all their glory. Is in the hands of a hobbit. He will be drawn to it. Fate has given us four. And he knows not. Fate has given us four. So he's basically saying how he's gonna try and pretend that Pippin's got it and then they're gonna go to Minas Tirith. And this is where he shits a brick. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> they think I got it, fuck that. Oh this is epic. Okay, so this is going to be like a Minas Tirith mission. We already played the Pelennor Fields where we had our fucking army of the dead. I hate them. Yeah, so we're going to be playing in Minas Tirith. We've already played Pelennor Fields, which is outside of Minas Tirith. But now we're actually going to be inside the city doing some fighting as Gandalf. And what's interesting is, you know I say I hate, uh, I hate the past of the dead. They're not actually, in the books, they're not actually really like that. They don't just go around killing everyone. And they don't actually help out in the Pelennor Fields either. They only help against the Corsairs. So, yeah, it's not so fucked up in the book and it doesn't spoil it so much. This guy's a legend, Denifor. Absolute nutter. Burns himself alive. Uh, Denifor's a steward of Gondor, so he's not the king, but he's looking after the throne and he gets all pissed that Aragorn's coming back and he's gonna... He's going to take his favourite seat, which is the throne of uh, Gondor. He's not too happy about that. Anyway, we're going in now. This deal will turn into game people soon, I think. We're ready to go. Okay, just at the start of this game, also, a couple of people in the comment section. Obviously, you guys, uh, you guys have been watching this and watching me ramble on over some of the gameplay. And some of you guys actually want to play it yourself and you don't know how. And... Uh, I've noticed a couple of people ask that for the Let's Play, so I'll just talk you through this so that um, you guys all know. And I think I've got to kick down ladders here to stop us getting overrun. Uh, but what you have to do is uh, to play it on your Xbox 360. Uh, is just buy a normal Xbox game. Uh, buy, it, buy it as a normal Xbox game and it's backwards compatible. So it will play, you just won't be able to go online or anything while you're doing it. Uh, now this works for the Third Age, Return of the King... Uh, it doesn't work for two towers, only some of the games are backward compatible. Uh, but yeah, I just I, I got mine from Kex for £1.50, which is just a ridiculous bargain. Um, oh, let's take that one out quick. Uh, which is a ridiculous bargain when you think of how cool this game is. So I definitely recommend it. I think Third Age was a little bit more, something like £3. Um, and I'm giving that a break at the moment whilst I get uh, this one done, because I know there's a lot of episodes in it. Uh, so there, yeah, that's how you do it. You just just go to the go to a Kex. Uh, if you're living in the UK, they should have one in your nearest Kex. If not, I'm sure like eBay and stuff like that, you'll be able to get an Xbox original. I'm not sure about the whole PS3, PS2 thing. I'm afraid because uh, I used to play this game on the PS2, and I'm not sure if that is backward compatible. But for the Xbox 360, it definitely is. And uh, I'm having such a great time on it at the moment. So uh, if you guys are enjoying this Let's Play and you want to check it out for yourself, it's really simple, and that's how you do it. And I'm trying to use a combo as much as I can. This this level gets so hard, and those fuckers get in the way so much. There we go, straight into perfect mode, though. I'm going to use this perfect mode less for kills and more for kicking down ladders while I'm in this shield. I think that's the way you stop them. That's the way you actually stop them getting overrun. Oh, man, this gets hard. Thing is, the problem is, is you've got your own soldiers blocking the way, and you can't you can't really do anything. Uh, I can't take down as many lads as possible. Oh, you can. Oh no, you can't do that. Okay, I thought you could jump down onto that lower bit. Oh, I'm gonna quickly go down here and knock this one down. Can you go down that bit? Yeah, you can do that. It just won't glow in. Oh, that's cool. So now I can, if I can <laughs> orientate myself, I can go over and get the ladders from down here without having to fight everyone, which may be helpful. And no, 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 I went the wrong way. I'm pretty sure I went the wrong way. Oh no, I'm in trouble. Someone's come along and burst Gandalf's bubble. Fuck, oh no. 
Hang on. Alright, I've got to take some ladders down. I think they're down here, the ladders. I'll take that one down. And is it this side? Yeah, it is this side. I get confused between which side uh, on the map. Because obviously the camera angles change. Oh, Gandalf. Oh my god. This is so hard. Oh, I, don't, I think I think it gets worse after this as well. I think I don't think this is the end. I don't know how long you have to keep doing this for. Oh, what? I remember these things. Whoever wrote in the comment section the other time that this was a hard mission. Oh my god. I've got to take out siege towers. I'm pretty sure as soon as these hit the the uh, tower, it's completely over. That's it. That's it. It's gone. Right, so let's go over here then. Thing is, I've got to stop them. Right, hang on. Ugh! That's not doing much. What about now? What about now? I think that is actually hitting it. Go on, Gandalf. He's on such low health as well. There we go, that's gone. Let's use this just to be safe. This is such an epic attack. Come on, it's got last. It's got last. No, I wasted it. I wasted it. Oh, it's looking kind of bad for me. Oh, I got the health, I got the health. I'm back in business. Yeah, I got to perfect mode as well. Come on, Gandalf. You've got to survive this. I don't know when he learns Sauron's Bane. I think it's quite late. Uh, I've got health, though. Oh, I need to go down there and kick some fucking ladders down. Oh, my God. How am I going to get out of this? Go on, Gandalf. I can't see. Good stuff. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, we're going around here. Kick a couple of these ones down. That was by some time. Oh, they got another siege tower. I'll take down that quick. Please leave me alone. I'm trying to take down your siege tower here. Leave me alone. There we go. I should be able to take this out quick enough. I think as soon as that lands, I, I lose. So, go on. Yeah, help me out, Archer. I'm sure that little arrow is doing a lot. Why is this thing not getting broke? Yeah, they're good. Okay. I think I think I'm looking good now. I think I'm looking good. I worried at first. God. Okay. I don't think there was any Arak highs uh, in uh, the Battle of Pelennor Fields, to be honest. But I'm, I seem to be fighting a lot of them here, so... I'm getting a lot of perfect moves off the most, so I'm not complaining. Leveling Gand level up. There's no more siege towers. They got another siege tower. That's ridiculous. I'm gonna have to use this just just so that I can get to the siege tower in time. I can't even use it. Oh my god. Use yes, 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 yes. No, no, no. What? Why isn't it working? Oh my god. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. It's not letting me use it. Oh, okay, all right, now. Okay, go, go, go. That was probably, like, counterproductive, to be fair. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Where is he? Where is he? Where's the siege tower? Oh, I got there just in time. Just in time. There we go. Three, four, five. There we go. Nice, beautiful. I did go down. Good. All right. So I think we we must have they got another sea tower. How long does this last? And these fuckers get in my way all the time. Get out of my way. What? 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 No? What? No, please. Was that meant to happen? Oh fuck. I don't know how long this is supposed to last, but I need to level up and stuff, otherwise I'm not gonna be able to survive this anyway. Let alone keep that bar down. I'm guessing I've got to go over there and kind of help out. Kick these down, right. Do with that perfect thing coming back, that little shield. I've almost leveled as well, and I think after that I learned my Sauron May. Get raped. Get raped. Nice. 
Oh. Oh, right, I've got full health now though, so I've got some I've got some time to shine. Oh my god, how many? Jesus Christ, how many are there? I've got to try and keep that red bar down as well with this many here. Fuck that. Um, I really don't know what's going on here. Yes, right, I leveled so I can use this. Good, 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 good. Thing is, with perfect mode, it gives you extra experience and stuff. It doesn't actually help you combat-wise. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to be taking that out or... Oh, man, I'm staffed. I'm staffed. I don't know what to do. I'll go into the corner and use it. Oh, I'll get raped. Okay. Can I take that down? Yes. Is that it now? Was that it? Oh, that was a horrible mission. I'm not going to lie. I didn't even have time to talk to you about much stuff there, but... What's going on now? Okay, so this Batroom Ram, you don't really see it too much in the film, but... Um, it's really important in the book. It's like a specially devised one called, I think, Gauche or something like that, or uh, something like that. Anyway, and uh, it's just some massive thing that loads of um, loads of like trolls and stuff control. And it was the first thing to get through the um, gate of Minas Tirith ever. But in the book, what's interesting is in the book, the uh, the Witch King comes and fights, uh, confronts Gandalf. And you never know who wins against them because uh, the row room arrive. Oh, I can't go past there now. Oh, down we go. I think this is. Whoa, who's taking a fucking flight? Who's flying or some shit? Uh, but yeah, uh, the Witch King just walks in. He just strolls into Minas Tirith after the Baton Ram gets through on his own. And then the battle begins after that. Oh my god, I think this gets epic when we go down here. I'm not sure if this is the next level that's epic or this one, but. Oh, camera angles are really weird. No! Whatever goes through those gates, stand your ground, and there's like some trolls. Oh, he gets a shield. He could have made that shield a little bit bigger and that all those fuckers that are on the ground dead, but whatever. That does look quite cool, though, him just standing there. I think that'll be the end of that one, and then we see what happens after that mission, I think. Yeah, that was it, guys. So, a really, really annoying mission. I'm going to say that's not my favourite, but I know the next one for Gandalf is amazing. It's really, really good. Uh, I think I must have got quite a lot of perfects there. I'm hoping I get the perfect rating, but I'm not sure. I should do. Yeah, good man, Gandalf. It's worth it in the end. I'm going to get my perfect rating. Oh, that was a hard mission. And let's see what we can get then. Killing zone, killing zone. I might get that for the fellowship. Uh, increase the amount of time you're in. Come back that you're in perfect mode. I'll get that for the fellowship. Even though I think I already got it for Legolas. No. Power of the planet. It deflects enemies further and persists longer. Uh, is that worth it? Yeah, go on. In. Uh, we're doing a Gandalf mission next. So I'm trying to get as many of his things as possible. What else can he get? Shield cleaver. Y Y B Y. Don't know about that. I uh, like the forges. Ah, oh, that looks cool. Yeah, I'll take one of them. Thank you. And, uh, he's already got Bane of Sauron and stuff, so it's all good. And we'll get that for the rest of everyone. I don't think he needs anything else. Is there anything else left to buy? Rise and Revenge. Can I buy that? No, I can't buy that. Oh, I really should have bought that years ago. Strength of Stone. Permanently increase your health. Fog of War. Why? Um, I'll go with Strength of Stone. Increase my health. Right, that's it then, guys. Hope you enjoyed, and as always, thank you very much. Good night.